Good morning, ladies and gents. So uh, it's raining outside, it's not very nice. I've decided to make a small video to show us three drills that we can practice indoors. It doesn't matter if you don't have a putting mat such as this one, a carpet or any other smooth surface will work just as well. Um, on this map, you can see there's already some pre-marked lines, which is very helpful. But the first of my drills will require either two of the alignment sticks. I'm gonna go one, and two. And the idea being, these two sticks now are gonna create a gate for my putter to roll in between. So I've got my target in the distance, the hole, you could put down um, you know, a small cut-out piece of paper, um, something that's a similar diameter to a, to a hole, and that would be perfect. So the idea of this drill, we're trying to keep this putter smoothly inside our little gate. And as you get better and better, you can make the gate a little bit smaller and try and really focus on keeping that nice and smooth. On a short part like this, Maximum length is nine feet, but on a short putt, you know, 10 feet and under, there isn't gonna be too much arc to the putting stroke. There is a little bit of natural arc, but if we feel and think about that putter essentially moving straight back, straight through, that's gonna be a brilliant little drill. And again, don't worry if you haven't got the markings on the floor, if you haven't got the sticks, you can use a couple of golf clubs. So we just turn the heads that way and that way. So if we do want to hit a putt, we're not going to get obstructed by that. And again, that works really well. You've got that visual reference and you actually got, it's effectively like a bowling alley with the side rails up. So if I do go crazy, I'm actually going to whack into my club and it gives that really good visual. You know, if you've got a super wacky putting streak, you're going to see it immediately. So just rehearsing, getting used to pointing that putter at that target, nice and straight, smooth straight, nice and low to the ground, trying to rock that putter, use the body, not the hands, the arms and the wrists, just that left shoulder down, left shoulder up. Nice and smooth, get that putter moving on a nice straight line, you're gonna hold more putts. So second drill, similar thing, but only requiring now one stick or perhaps one golf club. So similar sort of deal, but this time, my stick is aiming right at the middle of the hole, and I want you to find the line on your putter and put that right in the center of your stick. You're just gonna gently put your putter on top of the stick and just lift it by a few millimeters, and I'm just trying to trace that stick with my putter. So it's just straight back, straight through, nice and smooth. What this one's doing, similar to the last one, but this one now is really more aim focused. So I'm really trying to get the ball in the middle of my putter. It's gonna help massively with that because I've got right on the middle line on my putter. So it's gonna help with ball position. But what it's really gonna help with is that initial setup and making sure we're pointing that putter face at the middle of the hole. And of course, if the putt has slope, that putter might not be at the middle of the hole, but for a training aid, with the hole on a flat putt, let's get that confidently aimed at the middle of the hole, making that nice smooth stroke. And then lastly, my last little tip for you guys, I've got a small coin, I've got a 5p coin on there at the moment, but you could use a 2p or 1p or maybe even a 20p. I'm actually gonna put the golf ball on top of the coin. Now, what I want you to do with this, again, beside it, have a couple of nice strokes, get nice and smooth, Get that alignment correct. Just knocked him off there, a bit silly. Get that alignment correct. And, and the idea with this one, when the ball is gone, I'm focusing on the 5p coin. God, that was lucky, wasn't it? And my head is dead still. So I didn't look up at all. I did not look up. I just focused fully on making a good stroke, head down, focusing on that 5p coin or whatever it might be. What that does is it prevents my head from lifting up and changing the potential path of that putter. And as you can see, 
that worked pretty well. So although the weather's poor out there, guys, please do do a little bit of practice. It will have a massive, massively positive impact on your golf. Thanks very much, and I'll speak to you soon.